Hey everybody, it's me, Andrew Guy, your color commentator for CRL, and this is a segment called How We Clash, where you guys are gonna check out just exactly what I do to get ready for CRL every single time that we go live. I am located in sunny Santa Monica, California, where honestly this last year I've spent most of my time indoors, but when I'm not inside, I love to go biking on the bike path. I love to go out and eat. I'm a huge, huge foodie. So when I got started in Clash Royale League, it was actually through the in-game application, essentially. it was There was a, a tab in-game that was saying that they were casting, and I love the game. I've been playing you know, every single day for hours a day, so I thought maybe I could marry the two worlds of like loving gaming and then actually involving hosting with gaming. So here we are with CRL being the way that I did it. Yeah, I still remember the very first time that I saw my boy Rich Slayton. Are we wearing the same shirt? By the way, uh, I, think I think we're actually wearing the exact same shirt. I have to give you mine when I'm off camera, and now they just handed me a second one. It's really interesting moving from being on location to remote broadcasting. What's changed the most is actually like the morning ritual. It's getting up a lot earlier. It's making sure that, you know, I do my own hair. It's that I, I make sure that I have enough time instead of traveling. It's just making sure I plan out my morning enough. It's walking my dog, making my coffee, getting a snack, making my tea. All of the things that we usually have the luxuries of people helping us out with on set, we kind of need to make sure that we do that the morning of. And the first thing that I say to myself in the morning is, is a tongue twister. What did to do to die today at a minute or two till two, a distinctly difficult thing to say, but harder still to do. And the baby tattoo at 20 till two, a rat to tattoo to tattoo to tum, and the dragon will come when he hears the drum at a minute or two till two today at a minute or two till two. I don't know what it means, but it helps me speak. I really, really, really miss the hair and makeup team. Um, <laughs> I really do. I, I can do my own hair. I, I cannot touch my own makeup. So uh, yeah, I, I miss you guys. I, I really do, and so does my face. All right, so this is Snickers. He's a chocolate lab mix. He's a good boy, and he hangs out with me every weekend at four in the morning. So right now he's a little tired, huh? So this setup that I have here has evolved a lot over the last year and I've definitely learned some things. So I used to just have two monitors, now I've got like five. <laughs> I've got five monitors and an iPad. Um, so I love the setup, I love the monitors, I need it, I need to run a show, I need stats, I need to see the bracket. And, and honestly for me, what's the most important is I can see myself and I can see my other caster first. That really, really helps with that interpersonal relationship with my other caster that I don't really have anymore because we're not in person. The other things, you have to have the run a show going. That way I always know what's coming up next. Okay, right, we have match three coming up next between these two players. And then of course I have my iPad over here just in case I wanna get a game in, you know, in between sets. But what I'm the most proud of, even though I do love the monitors, is all this cool stuff behind me that I've kind of accumulated over the years of being a CRL caster at World Finals, at WCG, just in person meeting teams. Over here, we've got the great happy sad signs. I, I flip those around to the crying angry ones every now and then. We've got the hat over here. We got the white hat, we got the black hat. And then how do you not recognize the figurines? Golden princess on top, the log, the minion, all these things. I have the baby dragon, but that one, I it's, I, it's special to me. It's in my bed. My favorite piece of swag that I've ever gotten, ever, in the three years that I've been doing this, the three world finals that I've been to, was the original world finals pin, which is this guy right here. This is what we got in Tokyo 2018. So that's some of the coolest stuff that I've gotten over the years from Supercell. All right, everyone, that does it for me here in my studio. Thank you for checking out How We Clash. Now let's get back into the action.